Good morning, folks. Happy New Year. We'll keep it light today with a look at the sun and expected space weather this week, and also at a story that hits on the topic of hydrocarbon reservoirs and Earth's magnetic reversals. We're starting with our star. This week, we have two expected impacts. One will be from that dark coronal hole, its solar wind should be arriving middle of the week, and we'll do so on the heels of a CME impact that is coming as well. We have had several solar flares produced by the sunspot groups, with one of them releasing a minor CME at Earth two days ago. Yesterday, we checked out the Enlil spiral from NASA, which forecasts this moderate impact to occur overnight tonight or early tomorrow. This, by itself, probably wouldn't spark much in terms of geomagnetic storms, but it could precondition the planet for when the coronal hole stream arrives. NOAA's Enlil spiral is updated, and it is frankly a bit poor, suggesting the CME won't arrive until the 4th, which would be one of the longest CME travel times to Earth I've ever seen. Something tells me their timing is quite off with that one. We also have all of these sunspots to watch here. Flare monitoring continues as 2023 kicks off with several of these active regions. If anyone knows about the biotic versus abiotic arguments for oil production, they're quite contentious, and in this one we see the abiotic side getting their day. The paper describes the immediate production of hydrocarbons in the crust in the presence of discrete magnetic fields. It doesn't take eons of geologic time, more like the snap of a finger. And the number one way they list for getting those discrete fields is Earth's magnetic reversal, the magnetic pole shift that we're undergoing right now brings up a lot to consider in terms of the crustal aspect of the catastrophe and what to expect during this upcoming event set to unfold in the next decade or two. Would love for that to be discussed below in the comment section. One week until our January 7th event in Cheyenne, our first trip to Wyoming since 2014. Come kick off the new year with us. Tickets found in the video description box along with much more. Our books, playlists, and our January one-on-one -on -one call schedule is set. We greatly appreciate your support. Subscribe and we'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.